it's like I'm starting all over again raising children. I became a kinship caregiver when my granddaughter was born and they gave her to me in the hospital. And my second, I became a, a second kinship caregiver when I received Justin. As a child welfare system in North Carolina and all over the country, we've been placing kids with relative caregivers, in some cases at pretty high rates, for a very, very long time. I just feel that they feel that, that we're supposed to do this and, and we don't need the help, but I feel that they should help us just as much as they help the foster caregivers. For a foster parent, you have all this time to be trained and prepared and kind of get ready for a child to come into your home. But with a, a relative caregiver, that's not the case. You know, the, the child is, is placed whether you're ready or not. Kinship Navigator model has become standard really for kinship programs. Really the core basis of a Navigator program is to provide resource and referrals. So really understand the family's needs and then connect them to any resources that might be available. So our intensive case management program, the Success Coach program, which is, has been funded by the Duke Endowment, allows us to work more closely with those families in particular. I could call them at any time. I would always be able to talk to someone. If I needed something, I could always call them and they would always be there to help me. We need to make sure we're doing the best that we can, whether it's it might be therapy and counseling, it might be coaching, it might be parent education, but to really make sure that a parent feels supported and skilled and equipped to be able to navigate. Having those kids in, in my life, they have made me feel younger. That love that I, I thought I lost from having children around, they give that love 